You're listening to Jonesy's Jukebox, Kale OS. That was Roxy Music, Editions of You. Then we had City Boy, a track called Beth. Then we had The Who, Love Reigns Over Me, from Quadrophenia. It's Roger Daltrey's birth to t- today. He turns 75. Well done, Rog. <sighs> and I have my buddy here, guest, John Taylor. Yeah, turning 37. Are you? No. How old are you? Nice to be here. Thank you for coming in. You're welcome. Thanks, You're welcome. I thought you said in. you were going to send a limo. Didn't, it didn't show up? No. Oh, man, they got, must have got that the was address. Part, I thought that was the deal. You said, I'll send a limo. I said, all right, I'll come. They must have got the address wrong. <laughs> God, I'm to drive myself. What's it come to, eh? You know what? I, when anyone, whenever I go and do anything and they say, we'll send a limo, I'm like, no, it's okay. I just drive myself. I don't want to talk to no one. I know how I, want to, I get around. Yeah. I don't like all that stuff. Right. But that's just me. Mm. That's not you, sweetie. Mm. We were talking about Roxy Music getting inducted into the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame. <laughs> <laughs> yes. When is that? Uh, it's the end of the month. It's like the 28th, I think, or the 29th. It's in New York. Yeah, I'm going to be there. I wonder who's going to uh, induct them. Mm, I wonder who is. Someone close to our hearts. Someone I'm looking at, I think. <laughs> I'm so jealous. Man. Yeah, I think Simon and I are going to do it. That's so She's great. Incredible. Yeah. That's so great. Yeah. You love me, mean, sod. I mean, they, they were, I mean, when they, you know, well, Virginia Plain actually was the, was the bomb, that, bomb that went off, wasn't it? I mean, I remember yeah. seeing them on television, you know, and I mean, they were just like nothing we'd ever seen before, were they? What year uh, was that? 74? No, it was earlier. 72? 72? Yeah, 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 yeah. I remember watching it from Banstead Hall. I was put away for a year and a half, but they he used to in Banstead, and uh, we used they let us, uh, we were allowed to watch TV, and um, I remember seeing it on t- on top of the pops. Wow, that, that blew my mind. Yeah, it was mind blowing, wasn't it? Yeah, I mean, and I, I mean, I don't know how you could, you know, for an American for American kids, how what you would liken it to, because they were just like they were from out of space almost, weren't they? That's what I thought, especially when uh, Eno were in the band yeah, and he's, yeah, got, he's yeah. got his uh, thing, he's just twiddling knobs about. Yeah, I don't yeah. even know what he knew what he was doing. But <laughs> but that and, sound, and you heard that sound. There's a bit of Telstar in there, isn't there, little actually? A little yeah. bit, yeah. Joe Meek. A little bit, yeah. yeah. But one of my all-time favourites, that's so great that they're being inducted. I knew they were being inducted, but it that makes me happy that you and uh, Simon are going to induct them. Mm. That's great. Um, so yeah, we're here, you know, trying to raise money yeah. for St. Jude, and um, we got some uh, a few little items here that we're going to give away. It's a, a a Sex Pistol Steve Jones bobblehead, just looks, like the real thing, but it looks nothing like me. Well, you the, think? the guitar, the <laughs> pants, and the shoes <laughs> look like me. As far as the head, it could be anybody. It could be Paul McCartney. It could be anybody. Mm. And anyway, it, it's a beautiful thing, though. It does say my name on it, so I guess that's. Yeah. And I got this. Uh, got a couple of these uh, Jonesy jukebox uh, uh, coffee mugs from a coffee bean. That was uh, a little deal we had with them a few years back. I managed to keep a few. I don't think you can get them anymore. That's really nice. I'm going to bid on one of those. Yeah. Yeah. And I've got a pair of Sex Pistols uh, shoes here. They're green. They're nine and a half. They say Sex Pistols underneath. I haven't worn them. They're brand oh, new. Great box, actually. Great packaging. Real collector's That's item. It, son. That's it. Work it, son. Come on, let's go. Real collector. Look, that box so, is Are you going to sign this box? I'll sign anything. But I want to sign it personally to someone who ever wins it so they get it personalised. And that's it. Would you wear Oh, them? it's on the... Um, it's on the sole as well. And the logo, the, back, yeah. the logo's on the sole. Very tasty. Yeah. When were these? When when were these made? Uh, I think we did a deal with them vans a couple of years ago. Mm. I think, yeah. Well, how are we going to do this shovel? Yeah, so, so everybody who makes a pledge in the next two hours goes into the hat, and we're going to pick names at the end of the two hours each to give these away. So we're asking people to become a partner in Hope by pledging twenty dollars a month to help the kids at St. Jude fight cancer. And that's by calling 800-592-3449. 800-592-3449. And our goal is 20 pledges this hour. I think we're we're not there yet. Okay. 
Um, well, if there's any Duran fans out there, this is a fantastic, um, fantastic way to give. I mean, it's a no, no brainer. Yeah, the kids that sent you to help. What's uh, what you've been up to, son? Actually, we've been in the studio this week. We've been back in the studio with Mr. Ronson, the Oscar winner, doing Duran Duran yep. stuff. Yeah, and he's, um, he's flying high, oh, Mr. Ronson. What an incredible, incredible run he's had, and he's he's got a solo album coming out, a uh, new album coming out. I think in like six weeks, he he played played us some of it. It's a, it's a, it's a masterwork. I mean, he's really something. Uh, who say. sings though? When he's he... got different singers. He's okay, got yeah. uh, he's got Licky Lai yeah, sings yeah. on a few songs. Um, I mean, you know, he, he's the ladies' man. There's a few. I, I, I don't think there's any fellas. I think I think it's all all girls. But, uh, oh, Miley Cyrus. Yeah. Right. Um, yeah, but it's uh, he he's he's so on his game. It was great, and and actually, you know, on the six strings, we've had Graham Coxon has been playing with us. Oh, cool! Which Blair. is yeah, yeah, and uh, he's, inc- I mean, you know, he's amazing. Yeah, yeah, and a um, lot of color, bringing a lot of lot of color and depth to the sound of the yeah. band. So that's been really exciting because, you know, the four of us, Simon, Nick, Roger, and I, we've been playing together for a long time, you know, and you need a little bit of, uh, you need to freshen, you need to change the wallpaper occasionally, yeah. right? So, yeah. you know, having a different guitar player bringing in different ideas is really good for us. Yeah. Um, that was good. We just did a couple of weeks. You know, we were in New Orleans, New Orleans and uh, Las Vegas, had a few shows. Yeah. So, yeah, life's good with the band. Staying busy. Yeah. You're a good lad. We're good pals, aren't we? Mm. Mm. It's been a while, hasn't it? Yeah. But uh, it's uh, Chelsea Fulham on Sunday. Well, that's doable, isn't it? At Craven Cottage. Yeah. Well, they, they just got rid of, Fulham just got rid of Ranieri. So right. they got a new coach. Yeah, I'm quite excited about, actually, I'm quite excited about Brendan Rodgers coming to Leicester. Yeah? Mm. Yeah, I like him. Yeah. Um, but whenever, um, the only thing that makes me nervous about the Fulham-Chelsea game is whenever um, they get a new manager, they always play good for a right. while. Right. Right, right. You know, we're doing good right now. That was a good win over Tottenham. Yeah. I, I love that. Yeah, it's early, isn't it? The Fulham Chelsea, it's like six, six o'clock. Six o'clock. Mm. I, just, I just wake up and watch it in bed. Mm. I know. And I'll. I'll, I'll, I'll uh... <laughs> Should we play some music? Yeah, what, what's, what's, what about what's some, on the schedule? What about some Generation X? Yes. Kiss Me Deadly. Definitely. You like that? Yes. Then we should play a song that we've played on. Oh yeah, Planet Earth from yeah. the, from the Neurotic Great. Outsiders. Great, and a track that I played on your album. One, your last was yeah. it your last album? Yeah. Like, well, I kind of got shafted a bit. Well, yeah, it was. A, but those the bonus tracks are almost more important than the the actual tracks. <laughs> <laughs> I like the lead that I played on it. <laughs> yeah, it's great. I almost yeah. uh, Simon started coming and singing. I'm like, take his vocal out. Just leave the lead place. Way yeah, better. Yeah, I know. I know. You can't tell them. Can you, you can't tell these singers. Uh, they ain't got a clue. We have nine more pledges to go. We're, we're getting toward our goal, Steve. So we need people to call 800-592-3449. Become a partner in Hope by pledging $20 per month to help the kids at St. Jude fight cancer. Great. Fan Dabby Dozy. Let's play a... Yeah. Uh, John Taylor's my guest if you're just tuning in. Kiss me deadly, baby. Yeah, baby. <sighs> you're listening to Jonesy's Jukebox and Cal OS. That was Duran Duran. Hungry, hungry Like the Wolf Live. Where was that played? Uh, that was in uh, Oakland Coliseum, 1984. Actually, we were talking record store days coming up, and there's a really nice uh, vinyl, limited edition vinyl version of that recording, which was only available. It was only available as as a soundtrack to a to a TV film called mm-hmm. "As the Lights Go Down." So there's a very very tantalising vinyl edition with really nice artwork. And I actually just want to say we're going to have three copies of that album available on this show in a few weeks time right so shuffle you're going to put it up and then we're going to you know pe- people are going to get to bid on those albums and that's going to go to the st jude's excellent thank you uh organization well done johnny baby and then before that was uh david bowie hang on to yourself yeah then the neurotic outsiders doing planet earth janie jones oh, right. baby yes where you're on vocals mm. and you swear in it yeah you made me do it i know 
And then we had the neurotic outsiders, <coughs> neurotic outsiders doing Planet Earth, yeah. which you also sing on. Mm. Um, we started off with Generation X, Kiss Me Deadly. Um, what is this? What is the meaning of this, Johnny? Just got off tour, ending in Las Vegas. We talked about that. There's um, something else, though. Well, no, we talked about, this is about, as the lights go down, this is the limited edition coloured vinyl, uh, which is coming out on Record Store Day, as I mentioned earlier. That's April the 13th. It's a great thing for music fans, actually. I, I encourage all music fans. I mean, you and me, we're big retail. We still like going to record stores, don't we? I mean, You do. Well, I do. Um, I, like and, uh, I like pressing buttons <laughs> on my phone. Do you? Oh, yeah. you're so modern. I'm sorry to let it, let the side oh, down. God, you know, I'm not I, a vinyl guy. Um, I know you are, though. You are a real vinyl. But guy. it's but it's also become such a thing for collectors because every year people are putting out like very special, you know, uh, Li limited. Yeah, deals. like one day only things. Anyway, so the Duran thing this year is this as the lights go down. And as I said, you know, there's going to be I think three copies are going to be here on the show going to complicate your life shovel great thank you and uh, you'll get you'll get rid of them one way or the other we will did we meet meet our uh... we're very close it's the final day of the saint jude rocks radiothon benefiting saint jude children's research hospital and we have a goal per hour right now we're four away from that goal we need oh, four no. pledges call 1-800-592-3449 become a partner in hope pledge twenty dollars a month to help the kids at St. Jude fight cancer. Mm -hmm. That's 800-592-3449. Are we still uh, doing these? Yes, yeah, so Steve brought some pistols swag that he's going to sign and put into the pot as, a, as an incentive. Somebody's going to win those. Out of all the people who pledge in the next during the show today, we're going to pull names. Yeah, uh, it's a pair of Vans, Sex Pistols, shoes. Very collectible. Size 9 and a half M. And uh, two, no, yeah, two uh, coffee mugs uh, from Coffee Bean, Jonesy jukebox, KLOS on it, and t and a and a Steve Jones bob Cu bobblehead. Curiously lifelike, Steve Jones bobblehead. L looks just. I mean, just like him, really, isn't it? Large head, small body. Yeah, yeah. big head. Yeah. Small body, but um, you know. What are you going to do? Well, you've got to have one, though, haven't you? I'm I mean, telling you, Every man. home should have one. It looks like bleeding Paul McCartney. I don't care what you say. Don't you think? Oh, yeah, or D.D. Ramon. But I'll, so I'll sign it, whatever. I'll sign your papers, whatever you want. We're going to visit the Duke. When we come back, a bit more rock and roll. Listening to Jonesy's Jukebox on Cal OS. It is almost seven minutes after one bell on a Thursday. By the way, it's at the 1st of uh, March today. Oh, yeah. Is, um, that an, is that an Ides of March thing? No, it's just good that it's not um, February anymore. Why is that? I don't know. It was rainy, wasn't it? It's going gonna, it's gonna to pour down mm. soon. Are we still enjoying that, Steve, or are you over it? No, I am loving it. I love the rain. I know I sound like a broken record, but I don't, I don't care if it rains till bleeding spring. You know? Ah, that was a song. That was a fine song, wasn't it? What? I don't care if it rains till spring. Wasn't that like Shirley Bassey or something? Was it? No. <laughs> Earth a kit. <laughs> um, we're here with John Taylor from Duran Duran and uh, ex-band member of me, the Neurotic Outsiders. Uh, that was Blur, Park Life. Then we had <coughs> the Gil Khan Elpit from the album Play Don't Worry. That was Mick Ronson, beautiful. And then we had Mick Ronson again from his album Heaven and Hull. Heaven and Hull, hence, that's where he's from. And uh, this was like the last record he did. And then he died a little bit later from liver cancer. Uh, that was his version of Like a Rolling Stone with David Bowie on vocals. Beautiful. Mm. And... Um, yeah, man, we're here still trying to uh, get some people to whoop some money on the St. Jude. What's, did, what's the good number? Good first hour, though, right? Yeah, the good news is we reached our goal for the first hour, so thank you to our listeners for that. Now we have a new goal for the second hour, and we're starting all over. Those incentives are still there, the, the Sex Pistols swag that Steve was talking about. 
So we need people to donate. You can also text any amount to, you text the word ROCK to the number 785-833, and you can donate any amount there. So we'd like you to do that, and hopefully we can reach our goal this hour as well. Also, John Taylor said he was sit, sit in someone's living room for a week, so you could just stare at him. That's part of <laughs> what he wanted to do. <laughs> oh. It's okay, man. I'm just kidding. Oh, thank God. It's okay. Just because it's on the radio, don't Doesn't mean it's mean true. It's right, right. You know, that's the way it goes. Um, are we? No, we're not duking. We're going to play the Stooges. Do you want to thank the food people? You haven't done that yet, have you, Mr. Shovel? Oh, why don't I go ahead and do that? Go the, on then. Um, Angel of the Yower, which actually was last hour, but fellow Westwood, fellow in Westwood Village, launched their new California cuisine dinner menu along with great cocktail program. Visit fellow.la for more info. Do you want to hear some uh, stooges, Mr. Taylor? Yes, always. Some shake appeal, Mr. Definitely, Taylor? Definitely. Bowie, the Bowie, Bowie version, please. Only the original. The, only the finest for you, my Thank son. You. Jonesy's jukebox, Cal West, take it away. You're listening to Jonesy's Jukebox, KLOS, that was sweet, Fox on the Run, T-Rex, the Groover, then the Stooges, Shake Appeal, <clears throat> and then Bada Boom Bada Bing. We're here with John Taylor. Hello. Of Duran Duran, how are you Johnny? Very well. Thanks for sticking around. No, helping, pleasure. Helping uh, make some money for St. Jude's. Um, there's a number, one 800 5 Nine two, three four four nine. If you want to make a pledge to St Jude, again I've got some swag here that we're trying to auction off. A pair of Sex Pistol trainers from Vans. They're green suede. They're beautiful. And uh, I mean, where is the op rare is the opportunity that you could get some footwear that is quite as sort of like vomitudinous as these, wouldn't you say? And yeah. they're really out there. And, and, and they don't make them anymore. It no. was just a short period of time. These, these were a size nine and a half uh, in American. Got a, got a Steve Jones uh, um, uh, pop, pop rocks. Uh, Steve Jones figurine bobblehead. Um, it's got number 32 on it. I don't know what that means. And then we got a couple of... Uh, <clears throat> Coffee Bean Jonesy's Jukebox mugs. Brand new, of course, not used. Still has the, the piece of paper inside, you hear that? They're made from the finest aluminum. You're not going to get uh, lead poisoning. And uh, that's it. We're, we're trying to get pledges. And it's been going, it's, it, KLOS, it's something they do every year for two days? It, yeah, we normally it's two days. Yeah. Is that good? Yeah. You got anything, Shovel? Well, yeah, we want to give out the number again. It's 800-592-3449. Become a partner in Hope by pledging $20 a month to help the kids at St. Jude fight cancer. <coughs> or you can pledge any amount by texting the word ROCK to 785-833. That's 785-833, the word ROCK. Any amount you can pledge. You'll be a link there, and you can just put it in. You'll go into the pot and maybe get picked and get some of this stuff from Steve, which he's going to sign as well. I will sign it personally it's to whoever deal. wins it. Yeah. And John Taylor's willing to go into someone's living room for a week as well. Yeah. We're going to visit the Duke when we come back. <laughs> we'll see you in a minute. bit more rock and roll. Your Harley is all rusty. It's just... <clears throat> You're listening to Jonesy's Jukebox and Carol OS. That was the faces. Uh, the... Um, Chuck Berry classic, Memphis. That's from the album Nods As Good As A Wink. <clears throat> then we had Slade, Hear Me Calling from Slade Alive. What a great sound that is. <clears throat> um, talking about Memphis, ain't that where the uh, St. Jude's headquarters is? Yeah, I think that's, that's how we got onto that song, isn't it? Good choice there, John. Uh, and it's the final day of the St. Jude Rock Radiothon. And we've actually only got about 20 minutes left here, and we're only halfway to our goal, so we need to kick it into overdrive. We okay. need 10 more pledges at 800-592-3449. Become a partner in Hope, pledging $20 a month to help the kids at St. Jude fight cancer. Or you can text the word ROCK to 785-833 and pledge any amount. 
So you want to hear some little feet, don't you, John? Yeah, yeah, we talked about, well, and we were thinking about my, my girl who's in, my daughter who's in New York, Atlanta. Uh, Atlanta Bean. So we'll give this shout out for her. This is O Atlanta. Is that a real name? It is. Even the Bean bit. Yeah, so that's a middle name? Yeah. Atlanta Bean <laughs> yeah. Taylor? Oh, no, it's not Atlanta Bean, is it? You don't no. even know your bleeding It's kidneys. Atlanta New. I don't, God, I don't even know where that came from. Neurotic yeah. Outsider? Is yeah. that where that came from? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. But a little feat. Jonesy's jukebox. KLOS, take it away. That is one hell of a guitar solo right there. Isn't that still. great? Yeah, I mean, that's like... Uh, it was so fantastic to have you play on that. That's a Duran song for the, anybody listening who didn't know. It's uh, it's off the Paper Gods album. And it's Steve Jones soloing there. A bonus track. Uh, yeah, but, you know. Yeah, I'm almost there, and then it's like a bonus track, and I'm like, oh, okay, uh, I'm not really on the, the thing. Yes, you are. Yes, you are. Especially if you get it online, because it's, it's all there. It's all there. It's <laughs> 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 <coughs> oh, that was called Planet Roaring, yep. as you say, from the album Paper Gods. And then we had Little Feet mm. that was dedicated to your daughter. Atlanta Bean. Atlanta Bean. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <coughs> yeah, good stuff. Thanks for coming by, buddy. Pleasure, always. I f I'm sure you made a big difference to the St. Jude thing. We st you can still make pledges. Uh, uh, um... 1-800-592-3449. Gary Moore is up next. He's going to be still doing it, right? Yeah, he's the, going the through. Thing. So anybody who makes a pledge before 2 o'clock still gets in the hat for the drawing, for the swag that you brought in that you're going to sign. So they, we still have a chance to get those in in the next nine minutes. Mm. All right. They can also text the word ROCK to 785-833 and pledge any amount. I believe it's going to rain this uh, weekend, so uh, <coughs> get out your Wellington boots and your and your Macintosh. Mm, mm. Isn't that funny that a Macintosh? Now it's a computer, but when we were kids, a Macintosh was a, like a mat, a, a raincoat, yeah. right? Yeah, yeah. I wonder if they nicked that. And like Apple was a record label. That's right. Mm. Got nothing original. <sighs> nothing. Steve Jobs, nothing original about that guy. We'll see you Monday at 12 bells. See you later. Cheers. On the next Frosty, Heidi, and Frank. Hey, it's Eric, FHF producer.